So Houston has to get a haircut for his birthday, but I don't know if this is a good idea because he's already crying. What's wrong? Was it hamburger meat or? Yeah. Hamburger meat. That's it looked like it was calabaza in there too. I, yeah, it's like it was spot. Can I point out? Oh! He said no. Oh, you want to try it? Yeah. Oh my god, I think that was more marriage from the birthday though. <laughs> you with the The birthday guy. His birthday? Uh, champagne falling out. <laughs> She's got flies. Barbershop. Hello. 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 You gotta cut your hair. You gotta get your hair cut like that. Uh oh. Ooh. Oh, I need a back yeah. rub. Yeah, all up in his face. <laughs> you hear Ace? He ain't no damn bird. I'll hurry up. I'll hurry up. I'm going back. So we couldn't really show y'all much towards the end. He did get fussy, but we are out of there. Oh, hey. Baby got a fresh haircut. He got a little face. You looking right. You looking right. Ladies, type in the comments to let me know if y'all love that smell. I don't know what it is that y'all put after y'all get a haircut. You know what I mean? Huh? I love it. It's so hot out here. It's hot. Where y'all want to go eat? I don't know. I don't know. What y'all want, little girls? I just want kolaches. Oh, we ain't going to get kolaches. And we'll be back. Do you like Chinese, Japanese, or Vietnamese? I like Chinese. I don't like Chinese. I like Japanese, and I like Vietnamese. I really don't like the Chinese. It's like too Mexican. gooey. I love Mexican. <laughs> Why he still got tears in his eyes? before on the vlog I think I don't remember what vlog it was but yeah it is so good and it's right down the street from our house so I'm excited no ah no no ah. be back mine yep BRB <laughs> yo is it good it just ain't gonna be enough for all of us Houston's over here being bad. Thank you. Egg rolls. 
delicious. This cure hangover right here. Nice. Tell them what that is, baby. This, this is Vietnamese menudo. That is not menudo. So he got some pho on deck. The girls eating the chicken fried rice. Some uh, shrimp sticks. What are you doing? Four stars. Maybe even five. Three for me. Five, four. So this is the usual whenever the usual usual. 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 <laughs> this is the use use the usual aftermath <laughs> when we tear up some food at a restaurant. But look at this mess though. Sorry, not sorry, but it was delicious. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. And right now, I really don't know what we're gonna. Leah, put your. <laughs> Y'all, look at Leah. What is she doing? She took her whole shoe off, then took her sock off. <laughs> Nasty. This one has been acting up since we got here. So we're about to leave and we'll get back to y'all. So I ended up hopping in the bourbon because um, I am going to go get my nails done and I'm bringing the girls with me so they can get their nails done too. Y'all are going to come with us and we about to get, you know what I'm saying, treated like queens. So let's get it. Put your seatbelt on. What color are you going to get? Teal, but I don't know. Teal. Leo, what color are you going to get? I don't know yet because I don't know what I'm going to wear. Look at me. What color are you gonna get? Color because I don't know what I'm gonna get. Do not. Okay, so I'm gonna let them pick out their colors and then we're gonna get situated. Oh, we got dark. Then we're gonna get situated. You guys, it is so hot. It, it is so hot out here in Houston. I had to change. I was wearing a dress and I thought that was gonna like keep me cool, but it didn't. I was actually sweating my thighs off. So I went home and I threw this shirt on. Shout out to all our fans that send us fan mail. And I'll be back. She has toes just like her daddy. Yeah, you're so pretty. Why are you saying you're so ugly? Mm -hmm. What you got going on, Cece? Oh, you look cute. I need to take my shoes off. Not right now. Oh, yeah, cute. <laughs> hey guys, so I just got my nails done. Oh, boy! Oh, boy! Do you want to see my nails? Wait, so like my nails? Those are CC's. They go low in the dark. And Wait, mine, look at mine, look at mine. So so look at mine. So and so do my toenails. Wait, it's not focused. Let me see them stop moving here. Yeah. Okay, yeah, so we're going to our Thea's house to the pool. And... <laughs> Close the door. So I'm walking because I was tracking an order that I had ordered from Macy's, which is Houston's clothes for his birthday party. And it says it's delivered, but it's not at my doorstep. Oh, you nasty little. Anyways, it's not at my doorstep, so I'm guessing it's at my mailbox. And if it's not, I'm gonna be very upset, you guys. I'm gonna be upset because you made me walk 10 feet. So I brought my boys. The girls are gone, cause you know, they were getting annoyed. I'm just kidding, I'm just joking, I'm just joking. <laughs> I have Houston and I have Kingston. Um, you know, I meant to do that. This is what I was talking about. We have like those type of mailboxes. Throw the keys. Throw them. Hold on, it's stuck on my finger. Record me catching the keys and I open it. It's stuck on my finger. 
No, it's 11. That's not the key, you big dummy. That's the one you were holding. Dad just flipped the clip to act like I knew what key it was. Hey, Macy. Macy's, Macy's, Macy's. I'll stop. Yay! This is the party before the party. Got all the stuff to make seven layer dip. Okay, so. Houston's having a space themed party, if y'all did not know. We're gonna eat some fried shrimp and the best steak you ever had. So this here is the best steak. I'm gonna show you how to cook one. I'm gonna walk you through how to make the best steak you ever ate in your life. This is like if you took the best, baddest cow in Japan and brought it over here and made it with a, the best bull from Texas, and that's how you get you Wagyu steak. I'm telling you, you know what you're talking about, man. I know what I'm talking about. This is a hybrid of a Japanese steak made it with an Angus bull. Come here, look at all the marble on this bad boy. You see that marble? Boy, this this the, this this steak right here at the at the steakhouse it costs you sixty five dollars. So what you do is you don't gotta you don't gotta do nothing to it but add salt and oil. That's it. Get, the, get a close up on that marble. Get a close up on that marble and all that. Oh yeah, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is gonna make your mouth water right here. You get you some oil. Don't matter what kind of oil, just some good old oil. Dabble do ya. So we're gonna put some salt. Then we're gonna turn that bad boy over. Bam! So this is like a Kobe cow. You know, they massage Kobe cows in Japan. They give them beer so they can be relaxed. A stress-free cow is the best cow you can eat. You know, when you eat an animal that's full of stress, you're going to get all that stress, all that bad energy, you're going to get it up in your body. But when you eat a cow that's been chilling all day, getting massaged, drinking beer, that's what they feed those cows in Japan. You know I got the trusty chimney. Trusty chimney at work. Oh, don't worry about what I'm drinking. That's a homemade michelada. Now we're gonna shut it and we're gonna let it cook for about six and a half minutes on one side and about seven on the other. All right, so since I was frying some shrimp, I was like, Kingston, do you know how to fry shrimp? And he said, nope. So I was like, well, you gonna learn today. You gotta get seasoned breading, you gotta get flour, you mix it in this, and you got eggs. You put whatever food you wanna fry inside this little mixture. And then you go like this, and you put the eggs, you put it inside the eggs, and then get it out like this. You put it in the eggs to get it like sticky, so like it can all, uh, you know, stick to the flour. And then you lay it. This is the most important thing. Keep it on low temperature because it's gonna cook, and they cook quick. So we're gonna get our and start flipping them as we go because, like I said, they cook quick. We're gonna go ahead and finish these off and we'll be back. Let's see how it's rolling. Been cooking for about a good six, seven minutes. Oh yeah, you see that baby? Do you see that? And that's all we're gonna do? That's it. We're gonna let it cook on that side for about another seven minutes and you're ready to go, baby. My fire getting hot, so I'm gonna close this down. All right, so it's been cooking about seven minutes on each side, somewhere around there. My math ain't right, but you know. Six or seven minutes, shut the door. 
So it's been cooking about six, seven minutes on each side, and I think it's ready. It's smelling delicious. I don't know what these little kids gonna eat, but I'm gonna eat this right here. Oh yeah, baby. Mouth water and juicy steak. Oh yeah, it's ready. So what you do is you get it, you put it on foil, and you wrap it. And it's gonna cook for about another five minutes in the foil. We're gonna put some butter on top. We're gonna get some of this whipped butter. And you put the whipped butter on top, like so. He said, please, go take him over there. When you see me recording, I understand there with the screaming baby. Take them outside. This how it really is in the house. You know what I'm saying? This y'all getting uh, raw, uncut footage. Anyway, so you put the butter on there. You close it up. Bam! And now you're gonna leave it there for like five minutes, and it's still gonna cook on the inside. If you take it and just cut straight into it, fresh off the grill, it's not gonna be right. You gotta let all them in juices marinate up in there for about five minutes. This is the party before the party. Everything's ready. I'm finna dig into this steak, eat some of these shrimp, edit this video, and upload it for y'all. And we'll be back with y'all tomorrow for Houston's birthday celebration. So y'all stay tuned. We're gonna have the whole house decorated. We're gonna have a lot of family and friends over. So y'all stay tuned for that. Before I go, I wanna give a shout out to everybody watching right now. Oh. And if you want to cop this shirt I got on, play it made, stay true, Luciano TV, represent. The link is in the description, LucianoTV.com. Wait, Dad, can I try some? You want to be the taste tester? Yeah. All right, Gigi wants to be the taste tester. Go ahead. I done started eating it. It's, it's delicious to me. How you like it? That's really good. It's good, huh? Yeah. I'm feeling really, really good. Gigi's the bougie one of our kids, so she knows High class. <laughs> Jean Vieve. She don't, she don't play that. Uh, oh, shrimp. Oh, Lord. Here he come. I made the shrimp. Oh, Well, I ain't tasted it yet. I need some lemon for my shrimp. I know. The shrimp is on point. See? Steak and shrimp on mine, baby. Because we love it. Switch and drink everywhere we go. Switching lanes every 24. Smoking good everywhere we go. Every 24 Smoking good everywhere we roll